July is our anniversary, right? July 26 is our anniversary. Wow, mashallah, you know. Oh, yeah. July 26. Yeah. What year? 2011. Oh, mashallah. See? Hmm. I'm safe. <laughs> like with the culture, with their mm. food, you know, with their lifestyle. So you cannot, you know, come in their life and to just change tell them it. to change it now at once. Yeah. It is not possible. So like, guys, Hintay ko si Imran ngayon maligo kasi meron kami i-vlog ngayon. Importante to sa mga babae, mga Filipina na may jowang, Indiano. Hmm? Pero bago ang lahat, magpapak muna tayo ng mga orders. Pakita ko sa inyo. Yan. Nandiyan ba kayo? Oh, marami yan. Okay. Second batch na yan, guys. Oh, kagabi nagbalot na rin ako. Yes. Yan. Finish taking a bath. See? Yes. Ay! Ay! <laughs> Ay! Yeah. Oy, you did not ligo yet. Ayo, talaga, yo mabaw go. Yeah, we will go no, together with the Lego first. Assalamu alaikum, guys. Assalamu alaikum. Guys, yung mga bago sa channel namin. My name is Ai. I'm a Filipina. And I'm Imran. I'm an Indian. And we are Indian Filipino family, family here in Manila. Yes. Nasabi ko sa inyo guys na pag-uusapan natin ngayon yung most common na problem sa mga Filipina natin. Okay? About fighting for their love. Yes. Yung Indian man, Indian boyfriend, or even Indian husband. Right? Yeah. Na they're always saying that you should paglaban ka, ipaglaban ka dapat ng, ng boyfriend mo sa magulang niya. Mm. And uh, you should, he should fight for you yes. against his family, against his mother, mm. like this. Meron kasi yung sasabihin si Iman about dyan kasi before guys, in my previous vlogs, I was the only one who's talking, okay. right? Then I'm just giving you opinion from Imran's side also. But this is uh, different. Imran will be here, he will explain to us in, uh, in, in an Indian man's point of view. Para mas okay, para mas maintindihan natin kung ano ba ang iniisip nila dito sa love marriage na to ng Filipina at Indian. Um, relationship, yeah. okay? Because Imi, actually, we have uh, they have a problem, common problem in Filipinas okay, with that Indian man, even in relationship. Mm -hmm. They're saying that uh, Ate, you know, he's not fighting for me. The mother is against me. The mother, or even the mother-in-law, is always fighting with her. Even mm -hmm. they're married, ha, in one house, they're fighting together and an ending fights. Okay, yes. what can you say about this thing? No, the first thing is in India is we don't accept love marriage because we are following uh, arranged marriage. Even my father, my uh, forefathers, they were just, you know, going through this tradition. Mm. So now the generation is changing, the world is changing. So now the Indian also, the Indian man or the lady, they want to do love marriage. So it's very difficult for the parents to accept that. So this is the very first thing yeah. we are facing problem. Okay, and uh, in India, okay, we have this, uh, you know, thinking about Filipinas is like uh, short clothes. Okay, this is the thing. The how, we, uh, how, how we normally dress up. Filipinas. Yeah, normally. Short yeah. clothes, like yeah, yeah, this the revealing what? clothes. Revealing clothes. Yeah. And uh, uh, they have this like, you know, the thinking like, you know, they will not be for the family. Like, you know, not, Actually, our not lifestyle going to be. is different. Yeah, the culture, the culture, the culture, yeah. Yeah. Because normally, well, the mother-in-law is going and seeing the lady, she will check all the compatibility. Okay, mm. like she'll be good with me. She'll be like you know handling the fa family. Those are checking everything. Okay, it's like really they're doing an interview of the girl. Okay, they're doing the interview mm. of the girl. Like, if she can cook. Okay. I yeah. think so. That's the important thing. That's no? a very the, important thing in India. Yeah. Ki the the lady, mother, yeah. yeah, the mother will always check. Ki she'll make sure. Ki husband, uh, her son won't be, uh, yeah. you know, starving. <laughs> so to use this word, yeah. it, you know, not all, but not most all, of but them, yeah, most, most of, of the mother-in-laws. Yes. Okay, mother-in-laws. Kaya yung mga Filipinas dyan, you should learn how to cook. You should learn to be there in the kitchen. Yeah. yeah even we have this uh, career, because I'm a career woman before, you know. I have a job, but still, my mm. late mother-in-law, she made sure that I know how to cook. Right, Amy? Yeah. Her son should get a house food. Mm, house food. House food. Yeah. Okay, so the Filipina, like, who is like, 
uh, with uh, with a the relation or like you know planning to have a relation so just keep in the, uh, this thing in mind okay there's nothing like you know very difficult if you want you can do it no but i mean what okay. what are we, uh, what are they going to do like your advice to all filipinas who they can feel that uh, the family cannot accept me even the mother in law cannot accept me okay what she should do okay mm -hmm. she acceptance is uh, even is uh, depend on the person to whom she is loving mm he should depend on the yeah, guy right he should portray mm. her in a proper way mm. and even he should tell her things which is there in our culture mm -hmm. okay she should know so whenever she is like you know uh, like you know talking to them on video call or anywhere she should know how to talk she should know what to talk mm. okay yeah. so the first impression is the last impression yes okay yes. once the first impression is done then you can take be... another step yeah yeah So it is not like very difficult to get married and to you know to adapt culture. culture, because after getting married, I, like I and Zai, we are like more than ten years now together, married. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, and we have two sons. So before yes, even I have that fear. That maybe Zai will not adapt my culture, which is very okay for me, mm -hmm. because I cannot. I don't want to force anything on anybody. Yeah, this okay. the Imiko. That's yeah. the big biggest factor. Yes. You never force me. Yeah. Because. If a person will force me that ah adapt my culture like this, I will be hesitant. You know? This is what yeah. I will get angry. I don't no, yeah. I don't want like this. Because it is so, not yeah, and it is not easy. Sorry to interrupt. It is not easy. Ki like, Zai she born here in the Philippines. Huh? She yeah. have like given all half of her life. Okay, like with the culture, with mm. their food, you know, with their lifestyle. So you cannot you know come in their life and to just change tell them to change it now at once. Yeah, it is not possible. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's not possible. So it should be two way. Two ways. Yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. You should adapt. You should understand my culture and traditions, yeah. and also me. Yeah. I will adapt, but there's no force. There should, should there shouldn't be a force yeah. involved. And Imi, I can say also, there's those Filipinas married to Indian men. Okay, mm -hmm. they have this competitor between the mother-in-law and them. You know, I can I can also because I I know that this mother-in-law, the ladies, women's instinct, like mm -hmm. they want to be prioritized by men. Okay, so there's a problem between mother and the daughter-in-law all the time. Okay, for me, alhamdulillah, my late mother-in-law, she was not like that, you know. And Imran was the best, you know. He made sure that I'm priority, but same time, he made sure to his mom, okay, that she is also priority. Yeah. You know, all the relationship, okay, the harmonious relationship. I think Imi ha. Uh, correct me if I'm yeah, wrong. Yeah, I'm it, just, it, it will be based on the partner, Indian partner. Yeah. Okay, he should know how to balance things. Not he should show. For example, for you, okay, Mama will say something. Ah, do this, do that, do this. Then you will tell me, Ma, oh, Mama, Mama said like this, like that. Okay. Yeah. He's not like that, you know. You tell me, what do you think, Mama said this one? Do you think we will go for it? This is how he expl he's explaining to me, yeah. right? Amy? No, but uh, see. Uh, the purpose of making this video, okay, is like to share our experience, okay, and so the other new couple, Couples. yeah, okay, they will get help from us, okay, and we'll be very happy if we will be help in any way. Yeah, that Imi, you know, I'm okay. telling, I'm telling our our followers, they are lucky that Filipina and Indian couples are now existing here in social media. Yes. Before in our time, nothing was nothing there. Was there yes. You know, I was just you know blindly uh, what to do like this. How many times I cried there in India so, because yeah. of the culture shock. Only that. So in that case, even it was not easy for us also for me also. Okay, because whenever I'm talking to my friends, my colleagues, okay, even them, they will tell me something which like, no, no, it's not possible. She will not, uh, you know. Yeah. She will not adapt your culture, and then there won't be a mis. Uh, there will, there will, there will always a misunderstanding between you and her. But Imi, you know. Okay, so so many things was coming in my mind, and then it was really affecting our relation. Mm. I was going away from her. I told yeah. her, you know, we cannot be together. We had gone through that stage. Okay, because I was like very strong. I always like you know, uh, I will say like we are destined to be together. Alhamdulillah, mm. uh, and Zai was always with me. He like. What is the fear? She was like, you know, confronting me. Hey, man, tell me what is the fear. So I just opened up and I told her, "Kisai, see, you know, 
uh, there is so many things I'm like discussing because I'm very much confused. Like not not like today, as as I said, okay, like so many couples are there on social media mm. where we can ch- check their videos. Okay, we can we can you know uh, uh, find out their experience and maybe we can get help from them. So we were like not that you know fortunate to have that uh, chance in that way mm. in that time. So now what we want is okay for the new Filipino and all. First of all, okay, the man, because see, Filipina, make it very clear and uh, like yeah, think practical, great. and think practical. After marriage, you are going to go to the person. Mm-hmm. He's, okay. he's, he keeps on shaking the table. Okay, that's sorry. <laughs> so, so always keep in mind that you are the one who is going to go to his house. So you are, okay, your sacrifice will be more than him. Mm. You have to sacrifice more. Okay, but what I believe, okay, the ladies, okay, the Allah Allah made them very strong. They can adapt if they want. Mm. Okay, if they want. So before falling in love and before getting into relation, okay, make sure that you can do it. Yeah. Okay, because uh, what my mother, I always like follow till now. My mother's not here in this world. She expired, but you know she used to tell me something which is like you know like a nail in my you know mind always. She would always tell me that son, you know. In life, if you have some problem, you know, and you can cry for one day, that is better than crying for whole all your life. Okay, so this is what I believe, and I always tell people. Okay, mm. he if into in a relation, okay, maybe you are like in you know, one year, two years, and still you cannot find, he like your relation is not going. Yeah, yeah. There's so no. So better. There's no clear image. So better. I'm future. harsh. I'm talking harsh, but I'm talking practical. Okay. I don't want anybody to like you know. I don't want to give any fa- false information also, because we'll be in problem, we'll be in sin if we give wrong information, and somebody will follow our instruction and they'll be in problem. Mm. So we are very much clear with this, okay? So if after giving too much time and still you can find that the relation is not going good, you do it one thing like you know get away from that, cry a whole day, one day, or two day, but don't cry all your life. Mm. Yeah. Okay. See, I made. I was very practical, and I'm still practical. Even I have two sons. Okay. I'm here in Philippines now. Okay, and I'm going to stay here in Philippines for good. Inshallah. Inshallah. Okay. So now my son, they're going to adapt uh, Filipino culture. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we will take them to India also, but I'm sure they're going to adapt more because they're doing the yeah. schooling and everything here. So now I don't have to be too much extreme, missed, on them. Mm-hmm. You know you have to follow Indian also no, because I will disturb their psychology. Yeah. Okay. But never mind. I don't want that. Me. Uh-huh. And Filipinos, please, please, you know, be a, you know, be sensitive, and be like you know smart. You people are educated. Okay. So don't just like somebody say hi and then just just no. There was there should be somebody for you, because your link is only with the person in India. Just keep in mind. I was always like Zai, you know. Alhamdulillah for me because I'm so much of thinking person from all the views, I made Zai and my kids secure financially and with all. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah because I don't want because I have only link with me. Yeah. So God forbid if anything happen to me, then nobody is accepting my yeah. wife and my kids. I am in, I'm thinking of that way. Zai was always like, Ki why you are so insecure? I said no, Zai, no, hmm. I'm not insecure. I love you and my kids. Okay. So I have to think about you for future also, because there is nothing called guaranteed in mm. life. Okay, so maybe my words are harsh. Okay, but you know, Filipina. Yes, I want more Filipino in India, really, because you going to change my country. You yeah. people are see, you know, I have more civic sense than our people. Sorry to say, but this is oh. the fact. This is the fact. No, okay. Uh. Yes, it's there. For me also. I have so many bad things which Zai she changed in me. Okay, there was I will mean, not I will not say you know hundred percent. Oh, Amy, we're going we're yeah. going far away from the topic. Okay, no, we're no, talking about <laughs> no, no, just because I want to be emotional. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's okay. You know, sorry, sorry, I no, no, I miss my yeah way. the topic. Sorry. You know this thing. So, our advice for those newly yeah in the Filipino couple. Okay. Don't use this word. Fight for your love. Fight for love. you know. You should understand. You should have this uh, give and take relationship. Yes. Okay. Don't just 
accept whatever your Indian man wants and you should, you know, implement what you want. You should two side, two way, give and take. Okay? And for those Filipinas who already got married to Indians, okay? I myself had this feeling before that, ah, maybe uh, mama, he loves mama in-laws, more. In-laws and sister-in-laws. This is yeah, the problem there. Maybe, yeah, yeah, India. yeah. And I'll tell you what is the problem. It is not a problem. Mm. It is the insecurity. Insecurity only. Insecurity only. I'll tell you how. We are like, I born my mother son. Okay. He's the first born son, yeah. you know. So, then after my sister came and all, so our bonding siblings our bonding is there my mother bonding is there okay so it is so natural even in philippines i'm so sure about this anywhere in the world it's all same okay the mother never wants you know somebody to come and take away yeah. her son from our it's normal from there. Amy. it is normal it is, like it is normal okay it is normal even with the sister-in-law sister also don't want you know yeah. somebody take their brother away the from attention them. attention yeah. So that is the only insecurity, yeah, insecurity and that is natural. Only. But really, Amy, there is nothing you have to keep grudge on that. You yeah. have to understand this relation, which Zai is very much okay with that. Before, yeah, we had problem. We had even problem. With Zai. Before, because yes. I cannot understand why you're always like this. Why you're always calling like this? You know, I was like that. But eventually, I understood. I'm going to India. I understood everything. Okay, I became close to their in-laws, to my sister-in-laws. You know, right? Yeah. Um, I'm opening there some chismis chismis you know we have this chismis chismis together ladies the ladies chismis then uh to my late mother-in-law then after like so many years passed we had kids then i understood clearly like ah this is their culture this is their tradition so once kasi you understand once kasi you you what's this understand the thing the full culture and tradition the pain will not be here uh, yeah right there's yeah. no pain there's no grudges you know, you will not feel hurt. Okay? So, this is the problem. Understanding. Understanding. Only yes. understand. Then you so, will not have a problem. So, yeah. Okay? Just, so, I, we hope this thing is like cleared now. Okay? So, don't have any grudges with the mother and mm-hmm. this. Okay? This is common everywhere. Mm-hmm. Don't feel like it's only with you. No. It is common. Even Zai had faced this problem. Yeah. Okay? She cried also sometimes. Okay? And yeah, one more thing. We cannot, that we, we are sitting here. We cannot sit there in front of our yeah. mother. Okay. Like this? This is no. No. Okay, always Zai was complaining. Why it's like that? Why are you far sitting far? Where was but, my uh, wife? Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, then, but no. Yeah, she understood after. Yeah. Okay, no, this is okay. not only with you, even and, with my and brother it's in law. It's not only about. in Muslim family. Yes. Not okay. only. It's not even, about religion. Yes. It's not about the religion. Yes. Okay. It's the Indian culture. Culture. Yes. Okay. This is the respect for them. Respect to yes. the elders. To the elders. Okay. So, our next topic for. The vlog, just comment down. Yes, Whatever please. you want, yes. just let us know. Help okay. us to talk. Yeah. So we will we are here to like help. Not to help, only to talk. And to share our experience. Yes. Okay. To share our experience. Beautiful experience. Okay. We are ano? July is our anniversary, right? July twenty sixth is our anniversary. Wow, mashallah, you know. Oh, yeah. July twenty sixth. What year? Two thousand eleven. See? Hmm. <laughs> I'm safe. <laughs> I'm safe. No. So, till here, guys. How many years are we? 12? 12 years now. No. 2011, 2009, 23. 12, no? No, what you want? How many years? 12 years, no? Ah, 12 years. And the award goes to... Zai! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Chuk, we're fasting. <laughs> no, that's an award. Don't drink that. No. Okay, na. See yeah. Our next vlog. Okay, my name is Zai. Hi, my name is Imran. Okay, bye. Bye, keep watching.